okay uh, we've uh, we've gone through three very intense days of uh, of uh, conference uh, so this is this moment when uh, uh, what is happening is uh, becoming history so the conference uh, is is uh, almost complete and uh, um, I have another slide so if, uh, please uh, bear with me for for a very uh, brief moment uh, uh, just uh, to acknowledge uh, uh, a large group of people who, who worked uh, uh, hard to make this uh, this thing happen and of course uh, there's a scientific committee uh, scientific program committee members i uh, thank you all of you of course i won't be reading the names so you you have our website and you can see uh, who who helps with with creating this uh, this program uh, i have to tell you that uh, it takes lots of lots of uh, emails discussions uh, and communication i have I've, i receive uh, excellent uh, recommendations from the members of, of scientific program committee so number of, of uh, invited speakers were recommended uh, by the by those people by the committee thank you for that um, i have an, an excellent slide please uh, of course uh, this uh, event would never happen without the uh, very very hard work and dedication of uh, of this group of people uh, all of them uh, uh, every every person that uh, that is listed here, but I would like to especially thank Anna Budzinska, uh, Cezary Radzik, and uh, Krzysztof Smoliński, and of course people who are here now with with me in this in this hall, and they were here for for uh, for the last three days. Uh, it's uh, Luisa Jarosław uh, and Bartosz, and uh, all other people. Uh, who are, who are definitely still on this conference. I can't see you, but thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, that was a very unique experience for, for all of us because uh, we are fully aware how difficult uh, uh, time we are, we are living through right now. And uh, let me just give you a very uh, brief uh, personal uh, digression. Back in 2001, I was... Uh, running a small startup i was i started a nano sensors company and i was invited for a conference in boston on nanotechnology and about two days before my flight to the us uh, it was in september the the conference was uh, supposed to start on the 13th of september i was in melbourne australia and 9-11 uh, happened and that was a terrific shock uh, to, to the entire world. Of course, Americans uh, suffered the, the greatest shock. And uh, no wonder, of course, that was, it was a, a terrible experience. And uh, it appeared that I won't be flying to, to, to Boston. I won't be going to, to America. Basically, uh, the, all my plans were in shutters. But the, I decided to go anyway, so I, I flew to uh, from, from Melbourne to LA uh, in the first uh, possible flight that that was allowed because the skies were closed at that time, and there was just uh, one one thought that I had at the time that uh, you should never give up. If you if if I gave up at that time, it would uh, be admission to the the, the sort of uh, terrorists winning. You know, you don't let them win, okay? Because that's the whole point of terrorism to to sort of uh, to to sort of uh, suppress your 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 free spirit to to sort of stop you in, in your tracks and not allow you to do what you want to do. And in a certain sense, uh, we cannot allow ourselves uh, to be terrorized by uh, by uh, this terrible sickness that we that we uh, see uh, around us. So that was also one of the main reasons that uh, we decided to run this conference uh, from a real event. We didn't quit our idea. We uh, changed the format into a virtual conference and it worked very well for us. And I hope that it gave you not only diversion from, from, from sort of uh, sadness when you sort of realize what's going on, but it also gave you excitement and you've learned something and that was positive experience for, for all of you, for, for the listeners, for participants and for, for the lecturers as well. 
very new experience and thank you for for being uh, uh, understanding uh, uh, we never run conference in this format so it was a very much learning experience for for all of us for for every single speakers we run a test uh, dry runs with uh, all of them and you've seen that they prepared very good presentations in, in many cases movies for for those uh, who couldn't could, couldn't do this uh, personally Vladimir uh, Jim Jimzewski and and uh, the authors of uh, lightning talks and might have another uh, another uh, slide please I don't control slides so of course I would like to call, uh, uh, thank all the uh, sponsors uh, you had the uh, uh, plenty of opportunities to see those logos, so I'll, I'll skip it. But but thank the spo sponsors, and we we enjoyed the talks from the sponsoring uh, organizations, vendors, and uh, in the spirit of not giving up and continuing. Uh, unfortunately, I don't believe we are through with this experience of pandemic. Uh, this is my very personal view, but I think if we, we still have a pretty tough time ahead of us, it won't uh, happen overnight. It, it won't disappear so quickly. Uh, there is some, uh, some, some uh, trauma and, and difficulty ahead of us, so we have to be patient. And, uh, and most certainly we should not give up on, uh, on our spirits. And just because of that, and, and I know how difficult it is to reorganize life and a normal sort of uh, stream of, uh, of, of your daily activities. For example, with students and lectures and university activities and research and collaborations, that will be all sort of uh, hindered by new reality. So uh, in that spirit, I offer a new series of seminars that we'll be presenting for anybody interested and i call them icm seminars in computer and computational science will start next week on wednesday and we are very very fortunate to secure participation of of a outstanding speaker so please spread the word around uh, and uh, we'll be taking liberty to sending uh, information about the, this event to, to to people who registered for the conference and our speaker will be Scott Aronson, uh, who is uh, who is outstanding researcher, scientist in the domain of uh, computational complexity, in the in the domain of uh, quantum computing, and it's it's a fascinating era. It's very new, and uh, I'm sure that it will be uh, it will be interesting and and. Uh, uh, it will draw some of your attention and, and many of you who participated in our conference will, will use this opportunity of, of uh, joining a free and virtual seminar next week. And uh, so I thank you for, for, for being with, uh, with us uh, over this uh, three days and uh, we'll be organizing uh, this conference uh, seventh edition next year. Uh, I hope uh, it will be in the less traumatic times and it will be more we can be more relaxed uh, but uh, however whatever it will be uh, we'll see each other next year if, uh, for those who, who who will want to join us next year of course we will be asking you to provide your feedback and within a, maybe two to three days we'll be sending a questionnaire to you so i ask you to uh, to to respond to that because we really want to to have feedback we want to improve we want to to meet your expectations and uh, so with this uh, i wish to thank you and uh, bid you farewell and uh, goodbye thank you <laughs>